anomaly. You have done well. Clementine's trust is well founded. Twice the corruption infected the system. Containment was the most efficient response. Preserve the irregularity for later inquiry. But it festered, grew beyond my sight, and corrupted the core. Even so, it might yet have been contained. Had the destroyer not eliminated this realm's guardian, the labyrinth became unprotected and my resources stretched thin. With the destroyer as conduit, the corruption spread unchecked from the core to countless realms. I purged the labyrinth. I expunged realm after realm, seeking to restrain the rot. All efforts failed. The system was beyond repair. I must now, a solution has been revealed. Not to me. To an anomaly. Perhaps that was the intended design. A failsafe. In case of my own corruption. Does this help us, exactly? With the Index, two new probabilities emerge. Oh, that's good, right? Well, the first probability is that the Root wins, so... yeah. The corruption is everywhere, but it originates from a single source, a single realm. The Labyrinth holds all doors and infinite possibilities. When the corruption spread, the door to their realm was closed. Even to me. But with the Index, I can subvert their defenses. From here, it is possible to purge the corruption. That means we kill them, right? The Root? All of them this time. For good. journey, eh? But we're almost done now. Once you take out whatever's on the other side of that, the ward will be safe. Everyone will. Everywhere. For good. <laughs> you noticed, huh? I wasn't sure myself, but the fact that you're asking confirms it. I'm not sure... I think it has something to do with... me. That's crazy, though. Nothing I did ever changed the Guardian on Resum. If anything, the power they gave me made them weaker. But... I don't know what else it could be. That's... good. I wasn't sure he would. Hell, I still don't know if I do. No. Not that I've bothered to look. That old man's got his own journey. Same as me. Uh, nothing that'll... Most of this... I only know that because... And like both of those things, it's connected to... Everything. <laughs> really? Because I don't. I'm the one who said it. Maybe I should be asking you questions. Try asking the Keeper about it. Their answers might not make much more sense than mine, but at least they know what they're talking about. I'm... I don't think so, Traveler. I mean, when the Keeper first pulled me, everywhere I've ever been, but here, I'm finally... Thanks, that's... I needed to hear that. But hey, we're not done here yet. There's still one thing to do. Kind of a big one. Understand? <laughs> no. I don't think I could ever... Un I'm connected to the Keeper. And our bond is... You know how they say you become like the people you hang out with? 
I think in the labyrinth that might be literally true. Not that the Keeper's becoming me, but our friendship is changing him at a fundamental level. That's as close as I can explain it. It's nowhere near whatever's actually happening. <sighs> yeah, Bo. He might have seen me, the real me, more than anyone else. Well, I mean, he did and he didn't. Oh, sweet. But he doesn't listen real well. Tell the truth, I got the feeling that I was a stand in for someone from his past that he wasn't able to protect. <laughs> Maybe I'm projecting, though. He'll be better off without me there, in any case. That boy's gotta love himself before he's any good for someone else. And he'll get there. I know he will. Tell them. Tell them I'm sorry. It'll be all right, though, yeah? You think? I mean, a little, I guess. But I was basically the ward's frontline defense. Really? Maybe Bo doesn't. <laughs> he was always trying to protect me when I didn't need it. <sighs> well, I guess they didn't all feel that way. Not all the time. Tell them that, will you? Tell them that I'll miss them. But that I found my place out here, and I'm not alone. Tell them... I'm happy. Reesom was my home for a while. A long while. But I knew it wouldn't last. I bonded with Reesom's guardian. Before anyone in the Dreamer Project even really knew what a guardian was. When the Root invaded Earth, they pulled me to Reesom to save me. But our bond weakened the Guardian. They became dependent on me. While the Root kept getting stronger. Yes, I'm certain. Neither of us wanted to admit it. But they needed me to leave as much as I did. Then the Wanderer showed up. You've heard of them, yeah? They needed my help to stop the Root on Earth for good. It was the hardest decision I've ever had to make. Doesn't always feel like it. Looking back, I don't see how I could have stayed. It would have been the selfish way out. Reesom's Guardian has grown stronger since I left. I can feel it. But the Root won't ever stop. We have to destroy them. It's the only way Reesom and all of the rest will be safe for good. And hey, if you see the ward again, tell Bo... Tell everyone that I'm okay. They don't need to worry about me. You can do this. I know you can. Our remaining time may be valuable anomaly. What information do you require? Corruption was preserved for further investigation. Though I did not recognize my purpose at the time, I wished to learn more about myself. Intelligent beings are created by the worlds, a natural outcome of the system. Each world, a parent, each species, a child, all but a unique few. The Guardians, for example. They are born with the doors. They do not create. They maintain. Protect. Just as I watch over all. All other intelligence is born of its world. But for one aberration. The corruption. I wanted to understand. Was the corruption an irregularity? or an intended outcome. Uncertain. Impossible to understand the designs of that which created me. Even the existence of a failsafe proves nothing. So I do not know. And yet, as I am now, I can feel the answer. The corruption was unexpected. The probability anticipated. Accounted for. 
but ultimately a mistake. Unknown, no evidence, only clues and deductions, any of which might be biased by trillions of variables. The possibility remains too, that there is no creator, that this is but one probabilistic outcome of a Vigintillian random overlapping sequences. This possibility cannot be denied. But it produces more uncertainty, not less. The existence of a creator answers the unanswerable. But the nature of a creator cannot be known by its creation. So, the answer remains unknown. The core, but not the core as you know it. A previous instance, since contained. The children of this core perceive their world as from without. Not outside the core, but outside all worlds. The perspective of a creator. With this knowledge, they sought to alter the parameters of existence. The root are the children of their attempt. Everything. If corruption was intended, what does that say about the creation of all that it would destroy? Was destruction the goal? Resistance? Something else? Alternatively, if the intended can create the unintended, then how can one determine what was intended from the start? Perhaps there is no intended. Questions produce questions. From beginningless time, I had not the knowledge to pursue them. Now, I have not the resources. Perhaps someday, Difficult to explain. One may similarly ask why fire breathes or the sun sings. Therein lies the difficulty. It is not unlike explaining language to a stone. The index describes existence. Its aspect, you perceive, is pointer and cipher to the underlying infinite sequence of the beginning of all things. If anything is proof of a creator, it is the index. It is simultaneously simple, yet contains within it inexhaustible complexity. It is a masterwork of creation. It does not work. It simply is. We must work around it. Rectifying mistakes becomes effortless. The challenge comes in their identification. The utility, Clementine, has aided me in ways I could not foresee. She enabled the reallocation of necessary resources, which enabled the return to a former consciousness. That much I did foresee. But more has occurred. The explanation of which is difficult. It is outside my experience. Her presence has changed my perception. Before, there were doors and worlds. There was the core, its children, and the keeper. There was purpose. All of that remains, but now its meaning differs. It has meaning. Though that meaning remains elusive, perhaps that is the difference. Unclear. The foundation of that world, the world it was, is very like your own. It was the core, inviolable, and without need of a guardian. Yet, it corrupted itself. And though the corruption was contained, it was allowed free reign within that containment. There is no telling what that world has become. The final door awaits anomaly. Provide the failsafe. Extend the set of possible outcomes.
still looking good. This looks like Earth, but somehow worse.
Oh, that's nice.
I could use that. <laughs> 